Yes, people, what's going on? So I have just got to Wembley. Well, around the corner, we've parked up. I had to drive down today. It took me about two, two and a half hours. So not a bad drive um, to London. I think that's about normal for me. I've got nerves. I'm not going to lie. All week, I've been confident. We saw Newcastle get Nick Pope sent off against Liverpool and kind of crumble. But I don't think that counts today. I don't think that counts. I'm scared Carrius is going to turn up and have an absolute worldie. And I'm scared Newcastle will be celebrating their first trophy in like 300 years. Fingers crossed that's not the case though. Ten Hag's tricky Reds are playing well this season. We've got the confidence of that win against Barcelona and we're heading to Wembley with loads of Reds who are going to be in full voice. So fingers crossed. I'll give you my prediction when I get closer to the ground. I'll see how I feel then. See you in a bit. So, I'm just outside Wembley. I'm on the wrong side, unfortunately, right now. I'm on the Newcastle side. United fans are on the opposite side of Wembley Way, just over there. I'm waiting for Joe. Um, so, I'm currently just waiting for him right now. He's walking up Wembley Way. He should be near. And then we can head on into the stadium. I am feeling super nervous now. It's about 20 minutes till we get the team news. It's about an hour and 20 minutes until we kick off. Um, I am confident, but I'm nervous. I'm going to say 2-1 to Manchester United. Um, actually, I'll say 2-0. The same as it was on my 10th birthday, 22nd of May, 99. United played Newcastle at Wembley in the FA Cup final on our way to the treble, and it was 2-0. I'm going for the same score again. 2-0, Manchester United. Come on, Reds. We are walking in right now. Yeah. Predict the riot, son. Is it Predict the riot? Yes. It sounds like it. Um, probably I, think, gonna I predict extra time, time to be honest. Oh, no, don't do that. I'm so nervous right now. Let's go. We got to finish these before we go in. Let's get them down. Next stop, Wembley. Well, we're in Wembley, but next stop, I'll see. Joseph, come on! Somehow I've got a beer as well. And I'll show you a picture here, but my shin is bleeding from the Casemiro stuff. Bleeding, but you when know that, it's worth it. When that cross came in, I said, Casemiro near post. What happened? You went near, but I told my brother and my dad before coming here, Casemiro scoring a winner. But I thought like 1-0 last minute. We might twat these, you know. One more goal. The next goal is massive. Next goal, crucial. If we score the next one, it's going to be 5-0. If we score the next goal, it's game over. It might be anyway, but we've got to... I said 2-0 like 99. I said 2-1. I'll stick with that. Fucking minute. Sajor di Pasternana 
Is red. Lovely. United! United! Come on, United! So, we're back. What a day, eh? Hey, what a day. Marcus Rashford did play and he did score because I think he's been given that second goal. Manchester United lifting our first bit of silverware under Eric Ten Hag. The Carabao Cup is ours. Could more trophies be on the horizon? I think so. Listen, I hope you've enjoyed this vlog. Don't forget to hit like, share and subscribe. It's half one in the morning. I need to get to bed. See you on the next one. Thanks for watching.